the password system. I don't think it did that. Um, let's see though. So Spark Manger up next. You punk ass bitch. Shadow Blade gonna take you down, baby. Yeah, I like this one for sure. Yeah, this one's pretty much the Metal Blade of uh, Mega Man 3. <laughs> Very useful weapon. It's not as good as the Metal Blade, but it's still pretty damn good. It's kind of like a combination of that and the Quick Man weapon. Interestingly enough. And those are like two of the best weapons for Mega Man 2, so obviously... Yeah, shit. Plus, I don't think it's... Yeah, oh, it does shoot diagonally. Sweet. This is definitely one of the catchier ones, for sure. Nice. Okay. Plus, you can safely take this guy out with it. Yeah, it's just a great weapon. That sound effect is annoying as hell. Oh, this is fun. Not. Okay, come on, shoot. Stop it! <laughs> ah! Okay, well, hold on. Let's just get the power buster out. Power. I don't know what they actually call it in this game. Alright. Alright. Yeah, let's get back to the Shadow Blade. Oh, this pitfall? I don't remember if there's any bad. Oh, it's just. Just laziness. <laughs> to make you think, oh, it's a big drop. Okay, drop down here. Yeah, if you're quick, you can grind on these, and it's really awesome, too. But you don't want to waste your Shadow Man thing. All you can do with the make regular Mega Buster. It just takes a little bit longer. Now you want to switch back to it, because... Alright, let's move. I don't want to waste any more of that. Okay. Alright, let's just move, because obviously we're just, we're just killing time here. Now we'll switch back to Shadows Blades. There we go. Tricky jumping time confirmed. Keep the jump slow, baby. Okay, now we're gonna have to whip this out and show these things who's boss. There we go. Fuck you! Oh, thank you, thank you, actually. Because, <laughs> uh... One thing you don't keep in mind uh, with this game versus Mega Man 2, whenever you hit the spikes in Mega Man 2, it's instant death no matter what. Whereas if you're invulnerable while you take damage, you actually do not die instantly, so it's very handy. So here we go against Spark Man. I think I kind of remember him, but yeah, this stage layout is shit. There we go. But yeah, as long as you can get him doing that, you can just do the diagonal thing and you get hit a couple times, no big deal. Very easy. Okay. 